Local pharmaceutical products manufacturer Intravenous Infusions has expressed concerns about the depreciating rate of the local currency against the dollar on its operations. The firm bemoans that as a result of the continuous depreciation of the city, it's incurred an exchange rate loss of 2.5 million cities in the year 2023, thereby negatively impacting its cost of operations. At its 2024 directors and stakeholders engagement, the managing director of intravenous infusions, Muktao Swalihu, urged the government to work at ensuring the stability of the exchange rate for an enhanced economy. The following report has more. With the growing depreciation of the city against the dollar, businesses across Ghana are facing increased operational costs, severely impacting the pharmaceutical industry. Intravenous Infusions PLC, a local pharmaceutical firm known for producing and supplying intravenous fluids to hospitals and pharmacies throughout the country, has reported significant financial losses due to the economic situation. At the 2024 Directors and Stakeholders Meeting, Managing Director Mukta Swaliu revealed that the company incurred losses amounting to approximately 2.5 million Ghana cities in the year 2023. He expressed concern over the rising cost and urged the government to implement measures to stabilize the city and support local businesses. The city is pressure like any other business. Uh, it affects us because we import our material, raw materials. It causes us a rise in cost of our operations. Uh, generally, we can see that um, it has been very difficult you know, for every business engaging in importation and exportation, and we are not left out. Uh, if you look at the performance for 2024, sorry, 2023, you realize that the city depreciation cost has almost 2.5 million Ghana cities uh, exchange losses during the period. So it, it's, been, it's been very bad. As uh, any other business, uh, once the economy is not doing well, it has a general effect on everything that anybody does. So uh, in the pharmaceutical sector, we have a share of our own problems. Because most of the APIs that we use, we don't get them from Ghana here. You have to import them. And I can say that about 80% of what we use in doing these productions are coming from outside. So definitely, if we begin suffering uh, uh, losses in the area of your forex, then you should understand that it's going to have an impact on your cost of operations. Despite the challenges, Board Chairman Isaac Osei outline strategic measures that intravenous infusions PLC is adopting to sustain its operations amid the economic turmoil. I think, I think the pharmaceutical industries generally will also be affected just like any other uh, operating unit uh, in, in, the, in the country. But we have uh, decided that an export drive will help us to mitigate some of the effects uh, of uh, uh, the present situation. But uh, we are here, we are Ghanaians, we are going to stay and, and do our work and make sure that we get out of it. Ghanaians have invested in this, in this company. So it's our duty to make sure that we run the company well so that we can consistently pay dividends to them. Reports and 4 Channel 1 News. My name is Ni Ayukwe Okain.